the ultimate goal here is Vision Zero. As you've heard in the past, you know, you know of, as you're reporting, we have a lot of uh, accidents on the streets. We have some fatalities, which involve bicycles, cars, trucks. We're trying to reduce that. And what this does on 2nd Street, making it two-way, instead of a speedy area, we're reducing the speed down to 25, 35 miles an hour, making it a two-way, like I said, going north and south into the city. Gives another opportunity for people and the residents in the area to uh, make some growth in their homes, hopefully bring in some new businesses as well. Next steps from here uh, is what they call scratching. Right now we're doing what you call milling. Okay, <clears throat> that's lifting up the asphalt, getting prepared for uh, paving. Uh, we're about 34% inside the project. It, it, it'll, it'll start looking good in, in about two or three weeks because we start paving. Okay, so you'll see start the double yellow lines now. To answer your question in completion, done time would be mid-October, uh, um, early November. If you can envision, this is gonna be a raised a crosswalk here. So that's gonna alert the traffic that you're coming to a, a, a roundabout. Raised crosswalk. We're gonna highlight the crosswalk itself as you go across. We're gonna put brighter lights up. If you look, there's some brighter lights over there. One of the poles going over here. We're gonna put more signage to educate you about what you're approaching. So that could help the uh, uh, vehicles driving down, not hit, but hopefully pedestrians.